Hours later, the Saints and the Whalers played to overtime in a game interrupted by a Donnybrook. The heavyweights were Jack Carlson and New England's enforcer, Nick Fotiu. Before the game started, it was a big game. Nick came over to me and said, Shake, if you touch the puck tonight, I'm going to kill you. Jack skates over to him, says, you touch him, I kill you. I turned to Harry and said, this is great hockey, isn't it? In the first period, the Saints were outplayed. Bill Butters, a conspicuous absentee in period number one. Harry wasn't playing us, so uh, Glenn came down and he had a little meeting with Kurt Brackenberry, myself, Jack Carlson, and Harry Neal in a little, little cubbyhole of a room. And, and uh, Glenn said, what do you think these guys are here for, Harry? They called uh, Butters and myself and Kurt Brackenberry in and said, listen, we're going to start you guys and see if we can get this thing turned around. And uh, if need be, if you need to get something going, do it. Throwing some punches at Larry Plow. So at the start of the second period, the puck drops. They don't worry about the puck. They drop their gloves and they start hammering. Brackenberry gets two right hands. So it wrestling him now. 15 feet inside the line. His butter sneaks up. Shot on Plow. Bill Butter sneaks up. That's Plough. all. Here Brackenberg comes the match. Larry. We've got a wild goal here now. And one of the things told to Bill was, you know, if anybody looks at you, Bill, sucker. The despicable act by Bill Butters, sucker punching Larry Plow. We've got a wild goal here now. And now Nick and Carlson come together. Well, I got paired up with their tough guy. His name is Nick Fotillo, who was a New York uh, State boxing champion. Here they go, Fotillo and Carlson. You could hear the knuckles hitting their faces. It was unbelievable. And one each said to the other, are you finished? You had enough? Yes, yes. And when Nick dropped his gloves, dropped his hands, he, uh, uh, Jack, suckered him. He went right down like a big timber. Oh, Carlson just called Cat Nick. Well, we went at it pretty good for about 10 or 15 minutes. <laughs> I've never seen a scene like this, Bill, ever. I've seen many a nasty brawl, but never one as vicious and as long as this one. They boarded the same charter with us, returning to St. Paul, and uh, we were already on the plane, and then the Hartford team came on after us. Well, they're coming by, and we're looking, we're looking at the guys, and now Nick comes in, and his face is pretty messed up. And Jake Walton says, looking good, Nicky. <laughs> well... I thought another ball was going to start out in the plane, but we kind of won that series on, on that airplane. I think we won that series.